Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Alright guys, so I have another little video for you today. This time, it's to do with this Dura Clean uh, Shark Vacuum, uh, the Zero M model. Uh, now just to change the belt for this uh, this front roller here, I noticed that uh, sometimes it bogs down and gets really, really slow. Um, I was trying to figure out how to get it apart and uh, get to the belts in it. So I had, had taken it apart and um, found the belts, ordered the belts. It's a one 53-3M-8 millimeter. I uh, found it on Amazon for a couple dollars. So that belt's over here, and then the belt that drives this bigger brush is on this side, and it's a bigger, uh, it's a bigger belt. So um, like I said, I was on on YouTube, and I couldn't really find a video, so I just uh, started taking things apart and figured it out on my own. But anyway, uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is uh, you need to get yourself a really sharp pick here, and then there's a uh, cap. That is over this one here. Now these are both all 10 millimeter or uh, 10 Torx bit. They're security Torx bits. So uh, you're going to have to take them off. But first you got to pop out this uh, plastic uh, plastic cap that's covering it. You pop that out. And then uh, you got one more bolt here at the top. So you got to take this bolt out and this bolt out here. And then you're going to have to take this, uh, pop this front cover off as well. Uh, that there and you just want to pop these uh, torques out on the side here one and then the other one yeah I was trying not to really break it when I first time I took it apart but I was just like you know what got to come apart somehow all right so this that the side one's a 10 millimeter this one here is a little bit bigger in the bottom that's probably a the uh let's try the 15 it's either it's a, a 15 or a 20 but here's the 15 and the 15 fits in there so it's 15 on the bottom 10 on the side and um that's that and when you pull this apart you are going to lose some pieces here this little piece right here this springy piece you are going to lose that you're going to have to put the pieces of plastic back in but yeah i just uh kind of just grab this uh, side here and just rip it rip it off so uh i'm going to cut back and then i'll come back into this video all right guys uh welcome back so here's what i was telling you about here's the springy piece that i was telling you that would uh that would come out and that really just sits inside when you go to put it back together that just sits inside this groove here. You got to push this spring, uh, push the spring forward, and there's a little piece right here that it fits on uh, right here. It fits right on top of this. The spring goes right on top of this here when you go to put it back together. But you are going to need to get a screwdriver to uh, to pull it apart. And like I said, I just started. I started right here at the top here, and just uh, pried it apart right here and just work my way down through here and then it just popped like i said this always this has popped off both times and then like i said here's the little uh here's the belt right here and i think you just uh what you're gonna have to do is just roll the belt uh roll the belt to get it off i'm sorry there you go roll the belt to get it off so i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna cut away and then we'll cut back in because uh i'm gonna need to use both hands for this back up a little bit here so uh, guys i'm gonna go there you go guys i just uh popped it back popped it back on with my fingers and uh went on pretty easy here's the old old belt that i had pulled off here as you see there is a little bit of uh fraying here on the side some of the uh maybe the teeth were maybe getting a little bit worn down uh, it also feels like maybe the uh the belt may be made out of uh maybe a slightly different kind of material um it definitely feels thicker so this one definitely it feels like it has been uh worn down a lot you can see there is a little bit more there's a little teeth on this new belt are definitely a little bit have a little bit more bite than the old one so yeah it was getting worn down a little bit but that's it um like i said it's pretty simple guys you put that back on like i said i i, I fed the belt on here first and then I pushed it up here and I just spun 
this belt spun the belt down here and was pushing down with it till it popped back down like i said and all you got to do put that back on is to take this uh spring here push it forward a little bit and you can uh set it back in this groove here that it sits in Just like that. Then you can just take your cover here. Take your cover and just pop your cover right back on the side just like that. There you go. That, um, you can see right here how uh, that's where the actual piece goes out. And that actually helps lock on that, fr that front plastic piece. But that's it. You just pop it back on just like that. Put your put your uh, 10 millimeter back, your 15 millimeter back in and you should be good to go. Um, hope this helps somebody because, um, like I said, I, I was looking around for a while. I was getting a little frustrated with it, but that's it. All right, everyone. Thank you. God bless and have a great evening.